हेलो स्टूडेंट्स स्टूडेंट्स हम आज क्लास टेन का चैप्टर वन की एक थोड़ी कंफ्यूजिंग यू नो क्वेश्चन सॉल्व करेंगे कंफ्यूजन वैसे इसमें है कुछ नहीं है लेकिन क्या है एक्चुअली जो कंसेप्ट क्लियर नहीं होता दैट कंफ्यूज इज यू ऑलवेज तो इसमें एक कंसेप्ट है कि यूजिंग यूक्लिड डिविजन एल्गोरिदम हमको प्रूव करना है कि दीज टू नंबर्स आर को प्राइम्स और आर रिलेटिवली प्राइम नंबर्स अब जिन स्टूडेंट्स को ये पता नहीं होता ना कि वोट आर को प्राइम दे यूजली कंफ्यूज इन दिस ओके फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी वी शुड क्लियर दिस कंसेप्ट इस को प्राइम का मतलब क्या है इस को प्राइम का मतलब है वो दो नंबर्स जिनके जिनका uh, एक कॉमन एच होता है एंड दैट एच सी एफ शुड बी वन ओनली वन तो हमको इन दो नंबर्स को यूजिंग दिस एल्गोरिदम वी नीड टू प्रूव दैट दीज आर को प्राइम नंबर इट्स वेरी क्लियर तो मैंने आपको बता ही दिया है कि वॉट आर को प्राइम विच आर हैविंग दॉमन एच सी एफ एंड एच सी एफ शुड बी वन ओनली वन राइट तो हमें uh, इसको सॉल्व करना है वी नीड टू फाइंड द एच सी एफ ऑफ दिस यूजिंग दी प्रेजेंटेशन की होगी दिस एल्गोरिदम न्यूक्लियर डिविजन एल्गोरिदम तो सबसे पहले हम इसको सॉल्व करेंगे लेट्स डू इट Eight four seven is the smaller number, so it should be kept inside. Okay, long division method से solve करेंगे. Two one six zero. Okay, तो सबसे पहले इसको eight four seven into two. Let's do this. This is fourteen one eight and nine and sixteen one six nine four. So this is six and this is again six and this is four. Right. Uh, ये हमारा एक स्टेप हो गया है सो लेट्स डू द अनदर वन नाउ एट फोर सेवन का विल कम इन साइड तो इसको करेंगे एंड दिस इज डिड जीरो बाय इट विल गो फॉर ओनली वन इट इज फोर डबल सिक्स वन एंड फोर्टीन एंड सिक्स इट्स एटी वन एटी वन एंड थ्री राइट अब फोर डबल सिक्स विल कम इन साइड फोर डबल सिक्स It will again go by one, three, eight, one. So this is uh, five, and this is eight, and this is zero. So it is eighty-five. Uh, now three, eight, one will come inside. So it will go by, you know, uh, I think it will go by four, twenty, zero, two, and thirty-two, and thirty-four. So forty-one is the remainder here. Now eighty-one, eighty-five, eighty-five will uh, come inside. So it is one, zero, forty-one. Four, uh, sorry, it will it will go by two. Yeah, this will go by two. Forty-one uh, twoza. Uh, it is eighty-two. The remainder is three. Now forty-one will come here inside. So it will be one, uh, three, one, uh, three, three, and nine. Okay. The remainder is two here. So now the three will come inside. Two ones are two. One is remainder here. जो uh, one है that will be now outside and जो uh, two रहेगा वो inside आ जाएगा. It will be two ones are two. So here the uh, uh, you know this long division method uh, ends up here. We have found the HCF. It is it is one only because uh, here the remainder is zero, right? Now we need to express this thing. Express this thing like how. Okay, let's express this thing now. Two one six zero is equal to eight four seven into two, and the remainder is four double six here. This is the first lemma. We have done this. Now the divisor here will uh, will become division here. So it is eight four seven is equal to now. Uh, this remainder will become the divisor here, and it was by one, and the remainder was three a one, right? So let's write it like this. Now this. Uh, Four double six will become dividend, and the remainder will become divisor. Three eighty one and two. Uh, it was again one, and the remainder was eighty five here. So let's write it like this. So now this three eighty one will uh, become dividend, and the remainder will become divisor. And uh, the quotient is four here, and the remainder is forty one. Now this eighty five. Is equal to forty one as the divisor, and it's uh, again by two. 
and the remainder is three here and 41 will come here and the remainder will be the divisor into uh, 13 plus the remainder is two here. So uh, this will become the dividend here and the remainder will become divisor like this. Now this will be the dividend and uh, the remainder will become divisor and the quotient will be two and zero. So uh, we have done this here. Okay, I hope you have got this. Uh, this is all the presentation of the uh, Euclid division algorithm and we have proved here that the HCF here, you can see the HCF here is one only. So uh, at the end we can write the conclusion. Let me erase this. Uh, I hope you have noted it this down. Uh, if you are a bit slow, then there's nothing to worry about. You can pause the video and note it down, right? Uh, I'm gonna erase it, okay. Okay, now at the end we're going to write the conclusion uh, here, thus the HCF of 847 and 2160 is 1, so we have proved that H47 and 2160 are co-primes. Uh, I hope this there is no confusion at all now as we have proved it, proved it. Right. If there's still any of uh, uh, you are having any doubt in it, you can call me up or you can comment in the comment box. I'll respond to you and I'll call you back. Right. Thank you.